My name is Spousal. Or maybe Yorick. It's probably Yorick. Anyways, we're in Santa Monica. Yeah, just picked up a bunch of ammo. Mostly spaz shells. Exclusively with spaz shells from Mercury. And since I'm here, I might as well take a look around. See if anything's happened. This is the town where it's the bird all started after all. And we gotta make sure that our uh, auto level is still on because that thing likes to turn itself off randomly. And hey, why don't you call me sometime? Let's check our email. Nothing there. No news is good news. Looks like somebody's been waiting in this morning was stolen just hours before experts could examine its contents. Authorities are baffled by its theft. As it's the not very often I check the news. I probably should get quests this way, attempts. I think. Police speculate professional art and antiquity thieves are behind the sarcophagus's disappearance. More on this story as it breaks. The Southland Slasher... Oops. ...struck again, this time in downtown Los Angeles. The body of Sean Milton, a former convict that was recently released for good behavior, was found butchered, similarly to the other victims of he the sure serial killer. Was. Police believe there may be a connection between Milton's I prison past and the so slasher. Badly. We'll have a full report on this story later tonight. Simon what Heather's up to? host of local cable show Haunted LA and his crew are reported missing tonight. The team of the popular uh, they were reported missing a while ago. were filming around downtown Los Angeles. Nah, right, I'm not getting anything out of here. I'm gonna make a little stop at the blood bank, though. That I will do. For sure. I can't imagine Trip as anything different. I mean, he's just a vendor. I'm actually, I'd be a little surprised if Vandal's still here. It, because that whole thing with Alistair Kraut. Hey, Vandal. You next up for the needle? Hmm? Your donation could save a life, you know. This is the first time I've oh, talked to you. But isn't it a little late for altruism? I don't think you're here to give blood at all. I don't buy it, Jack. I bet you're here to take blood. Am I right? Vandal, you know me. We've talked before. Does the Pope wear a funny hat? Right down to business. None of this pretend I don't drink blood shit. Very refreshing to find a decisive customer. I respect that. So, what'll it be? Tasty crimson like nectar. If you have to ask. Blood. Blue. Oof. 200 bucks. I bet that restores a lot of blood, though. Uh, let's get a few. Three, at least. No, what for? I have a lot of cash. I have a lot of cash. And I won't be spending too much more of it, except on uh, that last armor set, maybe a few guns, and any ammo I'll need along the way. Not to mention the blood I might be needing. But it's been a while since we've been to our club, now that I think about it. And since I'm here in the old lady, let's see. Hey, need a day? I really don't. What's going on in the diner? Maybe I can talk to Arthur. Be like, hey, you know that murderer? I found him. Also, I killed him. Do I get paid for that? Where hey. would it be? No. It'll be nothing, apparently. Maybe Mr. Simplex is something uh, worth talking about. I get the feeling, though, I pretty much tied the loop on, tied the knot on this particular city. This hub. Robes of the hey there! Bird. I was hoping you'd stop back by. I got cool. word about Muddy Mike. 
Seems he was a victim of that serial killer fella. Crazy, huh? Anyway, you can stop looking for him, if and you were. I... Anyways. Sure, pal, what is it? Well, cool. He had something to say. Come on, fat boy, move. Or chirping crickets are keeping you up, or you have nightmares about them. Help me out. Oh no, no, don't you know? You don't mind if I hack your computer, do you, Arthur? Your father. Arthur, your father wanted me to write to tell you that he has a boil that's three inches across. You really need to come visit and see this thing. Love, mom. That is creepy. Like, why? Why? Why would you tell your son that? That's creepy as shit. Money. Nothing. No available commands. Why? Why? Arthur, get out of the way. Those countries need Jesus. I'm here to tell you, folks. There is not a single country on this planet that needs Jesus. Honestly, at this point, we could probably do with some more pagans, some more witches, people that actually respect the environment and want to not burn down the forests. Because there's been way too many stories of people burning down the forests for no goddamn reason. Probably the same kind of people that chopped down that, uh, that one 10,000 year old tree. Uh, you're talking about Teresa Jeanette? They cut me a check every two weeks. End of discussion. I'm no longer here. Anyways, I'm just turning up to the dark daughter of Janice. Yes, I saw it right. I feel a little dirty. There's a part of me that wanted to walk in here just for the music. Anything? Still an artifact. Hey, Therese. What's up? I don't have anything else to say to you. I won't forget what happened here. But I'd advise you to. If you keep silent and stay out of my business, we'll never be at odds. Just remember whose city this is. We keep it between our minds. Do you have any new email? You've been busy. No? I know. I know. Therese. Uh, yeah, her, her... No. No. It's a shame I couldn't save them. Also, it's a shame I didn't side with Jeanette. She provides more interesting conversation. It's not really conversation, she just bangs you. And honestly, you didn't want to. Um. Zero seduction, just the way my brain's like. It's kind of scary, actually. Uh, I don't know how often their blood refreshes. Going somewhere? I am. I'm going to downtown. I can still go to the... Oh, wait. That's right, that gypsy. The fortune teller. I, for I forgot all about that. Shoot the plane down with my pea shooter. Yeah, uh, when I went to the museum, there was that... That paper on the door it said, due to unforeseen circumstances, fortune teller so and so moved to Santa Monica Pier. And besides, I haven't seen the Thin Bloods in a while. They might have interesting conversation. And this doesn't look like it's going to be a very action packed episode. It's going to be mostly story. Story and me wasting time. But doesn't matter. You still have the pleasure. Of my voice. Hey, dude. You're the only one left, huh? E Evening. I don't know why he didn't go with his friends. I'm no longer here. Two of those were something I already knew the answer to, and the third was just insulting. I'm crazy, not mean. Except when I kill people and shoot them and commit horrible crimes like assault. But, um, 
Where was I going with this? Right. Ah. I mean, that is it. Matini Loita. Or, uh, Leota? I think it's Leota. No, can't go that way, apparently. That's a shame. No sense going up there at all. It's not like dungeons refresh or anything. Even if they did, you don't get experience points for killing people. You get expense points for doing quests. Or finishing quests. And I think you get a lesser reward for failing quests, but trying. But we truly have nothing else to do here, as far as I can tell. So, onward to downtown. And I'm kind of curious what going back to the museum will do, actually. I didn't know I could revisit the museum, if I, even if I wanted to. Where to? But first, downtown. Maybe I should have had Heather hang around for a little while longer. I mean, I didn't give her, I didn't let her give me the money and uh, while her kidnapping someone so that I had someone to feed on was a nice gesture, it was also incredibly illegal. My man, what is up? Fat Larry. My shopping cart is empty, bra. Maybe I'll talk to the Wizard King. Maybe I'll have something fun to say. You know what? I'm getting rid of uh, the music. I just can't do it, though. Not after spending all the money on that ammo. I really want to, though. I deeply regret spending money on that thing. My temple. Whoa. Oh, I thought it was a cop. I was like, why is there cops hanging out the front? That's not a good sign. Hey, guys. Money, right? Come back in a few nights. I'll have another ward for you. I'll do. I don't see enough sitting out there. I thought enough time would have passed by by now. My bad, everybody. Has it really been not that long? Oh, pretty lady. I can't remember Kaline's work. I know I've listened to them before, but I just can't remember. Huh. Well, I know what I'll be doing after I hang up the, my hat on this episode. Officer. In my mailbox. Oh, and the mailboxes, by the way, they're all linked. Like, if you have money from a completed quest in this mailbox, if you don't pick it up, go to Santa Monica or Hollywood or any other uh, sanctum in the entire game. It'll be there. And father dances in the dark. I don't know how that's a benefit of being a vampire, but it works. That have foiled previous there robbery attempts. Police speculate professional art and antiquity thieves are behind the sarcophagus's disappearance. More That's on the fine. story... Oh, well, Heather, you could have cleaned up for last. ...slasher struck again, this time in downtown Los Angeles. The body of Sean Milton, a former convict that was recently released for good behavior, was found butchered... Still not found. ...other victims of the serial killer. Police believe there may be a connection between Milton's prison past and the slasher. We'll have a full report yeah, thank. on the story later tonight. I wouldn't worry about the slasher anymore. He is no longer amongst the undead. Tories. 
You know, I'm not sure. I can't really verify it in the middle of the game here, but I had heard that that vampire in Alistair Grau, the one that was sitting in the beam of uh, sunlight under that switch, that was Patty's Tory son up, uh, not sire exactly. Well, to use Helter's term, Vampire Sugar Daddy. I heard that was him, and that's why he disappeared. Because apparently, I get the feeling the Jester Prince may have ordered him to check on the whereabouts of Alistair Ground before sending me. Which kind of just signals how high I've risen into vampire society. That, or maybe that guy was just incredibly young, I don't know. I had the feeling he was older than me. Hello, Neonate. How can I be of assistance? What's up, Wizard King? Might we try wood? Trade words, was it, King? Of course. May I mind your grey matter? What is it you would like to know? What do you know of the Ankaran sarcophagus? No more than yourself. But I do know that Lacroix is much too focused on acquiring it. His obvious need for it reveals a weakness that his enemies may one day exploit. What secrets lie beneath its lid? I do not know. Although I must admit that I sense a change in the night air, something subtle and not altogether pleasant. Perhaps the arrival of the sarcophagus is the harbinger of something more dreadful. A dark shadow, a curious hair, and the pillar ablaze in the night sky. You seem to know more than I about these matters. I pray that your visions don't portend the end of us all. What is it you would Maybe like he has to know? to say. Of course. One more. I'm no longer here. Although I do remember when I was on the Dane, I think it was in the police report, there was two things in that uh, container that was broken outwardly. The uh, shipping container, the steel one. Inside was the Ankaran sarcophagus, but in the report there was also listed a box with its contents as unknown. That might be a clue to something. As I said, there is... There's like three or four boxes, and all but one of them had its contents listed. It, it's, for the most part, just, you know, artifacts. Sans... not... not Sanskrit. Uh... I don't remember. But they were artifacts. Hey, kid, what's going on? Jack, my man. Sure thing, kiddo. Fire away. The Savannah are worthless, man. Fake tits on a zombie worthless. Fun to watch, though. It's like the Three Stooges with chainsaws. The Sabat are in the same business as the Camarillas. Sabat have a little longer chain, but they're slaves all the same. I wonder what he means by that. A little longer chain. Anyways, not much to say. How about you, Helter? What the hell did you want? Things. Where is the name of numbers? Don't expect to see him until this bullshit is resolved. Fair, fair. May I bang your grave at him? Yeah. Oh no. My brains. I see a vision of yeah. someone. Who do you want to know about? No. He'll only talk about who's here. Can't get him to talk about Abrams. How about yeah. you, damsel? Damn sale. Yeah? My curiosity wanes, I'm already gone. You just got here! And? It just smells like booze and piss in here. Or, you know, like any other club. Bar. Tavern. In. Taproom. Booze hall? Anyways, that's always been my experience of them. Never liked bars. Hated the entire feel of them. Going on dates in a bar, absolutely one of the worst ideas I've ever had. Not fun. Kind of oppressive. Honestly, if you want to go on a date, something simple, something that's not loud music where you can converse, and actually talk to the other person. I only have one thing left to do here. Can I go upstairs? 
maybe the prince but want an update about this whole weird Google thing situation. Sorry, no one's loud up right now. Or not. Need a ride. Which leaves exactly two things, and one of them I'm really curious about. Like the last time I was here as a perpetrator to steal things, shiny things, heavy things, wooden things. Wait, how do I get out of here? Okay, he'll take me out. Probably. Yeah, I know, I looked. You weren't there, Madam Yoda. Why does that let me come back here, though? I'm really... Oh, God. Burn it. I didn't see that last time. Why does it let me back... How can I... Oh, I mean, it's not like I can go back to Alex to Girls Mansion. That place was burnt to a crisp. You suppose they'll be mad if I if they catch me in here? I mean, it's like I, I can just disappear if they if they don't like it, right? Are there any cops here? They all leave. They all get. They must all got fired. No, no, not all of them. Oh, come on, guys. Stop shooting me. you have any idea how much that, that stuff mildly hurts? Anyway, I might as well just leave out the front door. If I can. Maybe I can. But this immediately got interesting. Stop right there. Look, you guys are going to end up killing each other before you kill me. You should really stop. Oh, it's so tempting. I suppose if I ever need blood, I can come back here in a pinch. Anyways, this is the exit. This is not the exit. Uh, <laughs> hmm. Wow, they're all just chilling down there, huh? Pardon me, excuse me. Excuse me, pardon me. How do I get out of here? Ending this video until I've escaped this place once more. Yeah. Still beefy ass guards, though. They don't even stop on shit. They just keep walking. Uh, I'm a couple pints of blood lighter, but uh, you know it's no big deal. Is that set? Oh my dumb ass! My dumb ass! This is exactly the route I need to take to get out of here. I think. There we go. No harm, no foul, though I just cost the city of Santa LA like 10 bucks in bullets. And who knows what kind of damage was done to priceless art.
Can't Hop get in. in here. Get this big yellow beetle moving to Kingsway. God help us all. <sighs> and again, I'm swinging my katana for no reason. Well, this is the mansion. This is. How did I get here? Oh, look at the little kitty. He's a stretchy little kitty. He's my backup. So is Whiskers. I heard him around here. But next time, we'll be assaulting this place. Whiskers and Kitty Cat Agent Orange in tow. Farewell, vampire.